Africa is a cultural gold mine with over 1.4 billion people in 54 countries, each with its own languages and customs. Africa is one of the most culturally diverse places on earth. Welcome back to Knowledge Truth Times. Today, we're diving into some incredible and honestly mind-blowing facts about Africa. Whether you think you know a lot about Africa or just a little, I guarantee you will learn something new today. So stick around, this is going to be fun. From ancient civilizations and breathtaking wildlife to modern day innovations, Africa has it all. Let's get started. First off, let's talk about geography. Did you know Africa is the second largest continent in the world? Over 30 million square kilometers. But what makes Africa so fascinating is the variety of landscapes. Africa is home to the Sahara Desert, the largest hot desert on the planet. Do you know that? It's bigger than the United States. That's 9 million square kilometers of desert right here. Then of course, there is the Nile River, which happens to be the longest river in the world. It flows for over 6,600 kilometers, passing through 11 countries. That is indeed a lot of water. Mount Kilimanjaro in Tanzania is Africa's highest point. It's 5,895 meters tall. And wait for it, it's snow caped even though it's near the equator. That's crazy, right? Another cool thing, Africa is the only continent that straddles both the equator and the prime meridian. That means it has a whole range of climates from tropical rainforest to arid desert. Talk about varieties. And let's not forget about the Great Rift Valley. It's one of the continent's most stunning features. This massive trench stretches over 6,000 kilometers from Lebanon in the Middle East all the way to Mozambique. Moving on to history, Africa is basically the birthplace of humanity. You had that right. Our earliest ancestors were walking around this continent millions of years ago. In fact, the oldest human fossils dating back around 7 million years ago were discovered in Africa. That's why it's often called the cradle of humankind. And of course, we can't talk about African history without mentioning ancient Egypt. The pyramids are over 4,500 years old and still one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. Imagine building that without modern tools. But it wasn't just Egypt. There was the Kingdom of Kush, which was located at the south of Egypt. It was ruled by powerful queens called Kandakis, some of the earliest female rulers in history. Talk about girl power. Let's not forget about Timbuktu in Mali. It was a major center of trade and learning in the 14th century and people traveled from all over the world to study at its universities. Who knew Africa was an education hub back then? Then there's Great Zimbabwe. It was a powerful trading city back in the 11th century. And the ruins you see today are proof of an advanced African civilization that existed way before European contact. One last historical gem. Did you know Ethiopia was never colonized by Europeans? It managed to maintain its independence even during the scramble for Africa. Pretty impressive, right? Now, let's talk about wildlife. Africa is home to some of the most iconic animals on the planet. And trust me, you'll want to see these creatures in the wild. You've probably heard of the big five. Lions, elephants, buffaloes, leopards, and winners. They got that name because they were considered the most difficult animals to hunt. But now we admire them for their beauty and power. Speaking of animals, did you know that the great migration happens every year 
in the Serigati, over 1.5 million wild beasts plus zebras and gazelles migrate across the plains in search of greener pastures. And Africa's forests are pretty special too. They are home to endangered species like the mountain gorilla, which you can only find in a few places like Uganda, Rwanda, and the Democratic Republic of Congo. Then there is Madagascar, an island off the east coast of Africa. Almost 90% of the wildlife there can't be found anywhere else in the world. Madagascar is like its own little universe. And we can't forget Victoria Falls, one of the largest waterfalls in the world. It's more than twice the height of Nigeria Falls and just as breathtaking.